Alexander Usi. Despite many criticising Usyk for his physical parameters being unsuitable for the super heavyweight division, viewing him with scepticism or even mockery, Alexander proved the opposite is reality. His victory over Joshua is a bright but not final example, considering Usyk's resume includes a truly formidable giant who easily overshadows even AJ and is comparable in size to Tyson Fury. Alexander Usyk is a man who sees things through to the end, unlike other boxers who may have four to five fights as amateurs and then jump into the professional boxing world. If the Ukrainian competes in amateurs, he finishes the job and becomes a world champion with an Olympic medal around his neck. Oh, you've got to watch it here, both of them. The referee could give a warning. Oh, that's better from Russo. Cracking left hand by the Italian. Not too far from his two former Italian Olympic gold medal winners. The great Nino Benvenuti, world champion, the number one seed in this tough division, has become the Olympic champion. And the former Olympic silver medalist and former world heavyweight champion gives him a hug. And the reality is about to set in. Clemente Russo in his third when transitioning to semi-professional boxing, he ensures the season ends victoriously. Ukraine, Ottomans, Alexander Usyk. And even in the professional ranks, this pattern repeats itself. Rumours of moving to the super heavyweight division circulated since Usyk's transition to pro boxing, but he only allowed himself to move up after becoming the undisputed champion in the cruiserweight division. These rumours were not baseless, as Alexander had been noticed working with Giants since 2012, and in 2013, he officially faced them in the ring during a tournament. Back then, Usyk destroyed and dominated many. World champions, young boxing stars, and notably gigantic boxers like Joseph Parker, Joe Joyce, and our main giant, Matteo Modugno. This Italian character is a true boxing monster with a listed height of exactly 6 feet 6 inches and a fighting weight ranging from 287 to 330 pounds. Let's compare the anthropometry of these boxers in more detail to further amaze you. So, Alexander's height is 6 foot 2 and his fighting weight at the time was 211 pounds. That's a difference of over 3.6 inches in height and more than 66 pounds in weight and strength. Before you think the Italian nicknamed the Grizzly was just a bag of rocks and therefore defeated by an opponent vastly inferior in physical parameters, I present to you his professional boxing statistics, which are quite impressive. Matteo holds several international belts and boasts an undefeated record of 20 wins and zero losses. Impressive, isn't it? Yet Yusik put this individual on his knees within two rounds and ultimately forced the referee to stop this one-sided beating. Celadrome venue is uh, yeah, the prize for one of these teams. And, uh, big ass this evening. Can he uh, produce a fairy tale? Yeah, the, the heavyweights dominating the, uh, the stage. With, uh, with boxers heavily tattooed. At uh, the moment, music staying up out of reach, trying to unleash a, a big right. It's uh, music coming forward. At the moment, um, able to unleash anything, and it's uh, the jungle. Being patient at the moment. Dungu goes back into the corner. Needs to come out and unleash a right, which he does. And does it very well. Comes forward again. That's good aggression. And the left as well. And the left finds a way through once more. Good start from Madungo. Covers up once more. Leaning in with the, uh, the left, but can't find a way so far. Covering up very well. 
it comes forward the right doesn't find its way through Madungo stays out of reach once more music not a big right over the top being aggressive now Madungo he's down Gloves cleaned. And took that shot to the head there. And uh, uppercut. And Usyk in the last 10. And he's been aggressive now. And he's really got Madungo in the corner here. And uh, unleashing a couple of big, uh, powerful shots. And we give it a go. Took the contest at Usyk. Open there. Dungo. And it does the right, the left uh, waiting behind. And it's the right, the left comes over. It's the right that does the damage once more. And body shot from the south pole. Left and the right, the top of the head and the body. Upstairs, downstairs. At the Holds his ground. Takes the body punches and those body punches. When you're sitting ringside, you can feel them. And they're sapping the energy of Madungo in this second round. Another wonderful left. And the left is, uh, is really doing the damage. And Madungo felt that it was uh, in low. He went down. Come forward. He's had a look over to. Uh, the corner, but he's uh, really struggling here, and uh, Usyk uh, stepped in again, and that's it, and the referee's seen enough, and uh, the superstar stops the contest. The blue corner, Alexandra Usyk. So Alexandra Usyk.